Break out the violins. British bankers are reportedly facing an epidemic of stress. Dwindling job security, constant rule changes, heavier workloads and a rock-bottom public image. It's all taking a toll. That's bad news for individual bankers. But Reuters investment banking correspondent Angelou Davis says it could also mean big costs for companies and the British economy. The banking industry contributes a, a large amount to the British economy, both in terms of money and in terms of hiring. And uh, the cost of pr protecting these employees against sick leave, against mental health illnesses, against time off uh, are, are greatly increasing. Almost three in four bank workers said they were suffering from stress, according to a recent survey by the Unite Union. 85% said they were working longer hours and nearly three quarters said they were thinking about quitting. Now the very lack of sympathy may be making the problem worse. No one likes to be hated and when you're seeing films in the cinema which, which show the, the, the greed of the industry and when you're hearing of endless scandals in the news, this can greatly impact morale and affect uh, mental health. Banks are trying various remedies. In-house counsellors, mental health first aid courses and even yoga sessions are all on the menu. But the stress is likely to get worse. Ten of Europe's largest banks have shed 130,000 jobs since June. Now the prospect of a global slowdown means they're under pressure to cut more. For anyone made redundant though, it might just be the chance to start afresh in a less hated industry.